Good morning, students. Let us continue with the chapter, the ashes that made the trees bloom. So yesterday we discussed that how Muko, the honest pet dog of the good old couple, was being killed by the wicked and greedy neighbors. So the owners of Muko mourned for their pet. When they got the news, they mourned for their pet. They felt regretted. They lamented. That night, the spirit of Muko appeared to the old farmer in a dream. It asked him to cut down the tree over its grave and make a mortar for rice pastry and a mill for his bean sauce. Now, dear students, the spirit of Muko appeared in the dream of the master. And the spirit asked the old man to cut down the pine tree that grew over its grave. And the spirit asked the old man to make a mortar. Mortar is a ball-like structure which is used to crush the grains. In Hindi, you call it as okhli. So the dog, the spirit of the dog asked the man to make a mortar for rice pastry and so that it could be converted into the rice pastry, into a dough and a mill for his bean sauce. Mill is a machine for grinding grain into flour. I am sharing here with you the picture of the mill. You can see the picture of mill over here. So the dog, the spirit of the dog asked the old man to make a mortar for rice pastry and to bake the rice pastry and he also asked the master to make a wooden mill for his bean sauce in which the beans can be grinded and converted into sauce. Soon the old farmer made a hollow place in the tree trunk and made a hammer of wood for pounding rice. Pounding means putting the rice over there, flowing rice. And they baked the pastry. They refers to both husband and wife. And suddenly, what did they see? They see that the whole mass, the whole dough of rice changed into gold coins. So again, even after death, the spirit of the dog, Muko, the honest dog, it helped its master to become rich. I am sharing few difficult words over here with you. Moaning means lamenting. Mortar is a bowl which is used to crush something. Incense means scented sticks. Pastry is a food paste made of flour. And mill is a machine for grinding grain into flour. Now let us see what happens. Soon this news spread to the neighborhood also. And as we know that the wicked neighbors were very greedy. They were jealous of the old good couple. So the jealous old neighbor noticed bean sauce turning into gold. So the neighbors also did the same thing. But their pastry and sauce turned into worms. Why that it turned into worms? Because they were greedy. And they were the only one who killed the muco. So their intention was not at all good. So that is why their bean sauce turned into worms. And they destroyed the mill which they borrowed from the old couple and burnt it. Why they burnt the mill? Because they didn't want that the old couple should become richer and richer day by day. The good old man had another dream. So now there was a second dream and the spirit of the dog once again came in the dream of the old good master. Now this time the spirit of their pet dog told him to take the ashes of the mill and spread it on the withered pine trees. Withered means the trees which have dried up. So the spirit asked that the mill which has been burnt by the wicked greedy neighbors you go over there and get the ashes of that wooden mill and sprinkle it on the withered pine trees so again i am sharing the picture of the pine trees over here yes 
and you can see the picture over here also withered you can see how the pine trees which were dried so he assured him the spirit of the pet dog muko assured him that they would bloom again bloom means the fresh new flowers once again will appear on the dried pine trees and the old man did the same thing as it was being told by the spirit of the dog so he brought some ashes of mill from the wicked neighbors and he spread a pinch of it on the cherry tree and to the surprise the tree was covered with blossoms the greedy wicked couple gathered the remaining ashes of the wooden mill so you can see the difficult word sprinkle means spread withered means dried up so you can see in this image that when the good old master sprinkled the ashes of the burnt mill on the withered pine tree so what happened the red color blossoms flowers suddenly appeared on that tree and soon this news spread in the village over there and now once again the neighbors also got this news so what did they do they collected the remaining ashes of the mill and kept it with them now what happened the very next day the wealthy landlord of the village was to pass by that road and according to the japanese custom all the people had to shut up their high windows why because nobody was allowed to look down on lordship they were not supposed to look on the lord a tall man who was a guard marched ahead asking the people to get down on their knees because one of the important personality of the town was coming across over there so that is why the people were asked to bend on their knees so again i am sharing few difficult words over here set out means departed from home impertinence means rude action prostrate means to lie flat competent means strong and kneeled means to bend so students i am just stopping the video today here only you are supposed to read till page number 61 and we are going to finish up the chapter tomorrow thank you